Hey everybody, and welcome back to Railroad Tycoon. So first off, I do have a new microphone, which hopefully sounds okay. I've 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 tweaked it and I've moved it around, so please let me know if it sounds uh, halfway. Well, I should sound actually really decent because it is a fancy microphone, but uh, please let me know. So first off, we have a priority mail. I don't know what the plan is actually. I will have to look and see what the plan is for this episode. Is that right, Evans? Pick up. Wait, pick up in Chicago. Deliver to Gary Central. Actually, that'll be... What was it? Am I delivering? Mail. You know what? We might be able to do that. Anyways, we'll just send him. It's fine. Okay, so the plan this episode... Let's see. We have blocked off the AI. What I could do is save up some money and look into buying somebody out. Uh, this guy's kind of expensive. 59 bucks a share. It's not really that bad, though. This is the Tuscaloosa the Jackson guy. I've never really messed with buying someone out before. I don't ever remember how to do it, but I mean, I know how to do it, but I've never really done it before. So maybe that could be a thing to do. Buy Mr. Cook here out. He has, does have a nice beard, <laughs> Mr. Cook. I hate to take you out of business, but that could be something to look into. Um, as far as growth, we can either go this way, kind of bounce around in here somewhere. There's nice somewhat sort of a town here. There's some really good towns over here on the Pacific Coast and uh, even down here in the California. Some really good ones to, to get to. Getting there, though, is going to be a problem. We could go this way, but there's really nothing in Texas. Even the Southwest as a whole, there's nothing until you get into California here. So the wiser idea may be to go from even from here, or even from Duluth. Though. I could just do a route from Duluth down to what are you? To Fargo. And um, that might be a, a thing to do. Luth to Fargo and then kind of bounce up way up here into Canada. What are you? Up to Regina, Regina, <laughs> Regina, Saskatoon. And back, back this way. Back down in here and then we just kind of hit everything. But uh, I can yammer some more or we can just go ahead and do it. So let's do it. What are you? What is this? This is a nobody town, but there's a, look at all the petroleum up here. That is a lot of petroleum. We're getting sidetracked again. Okay, we're going to do... We're going to come out of Duluth, because Duluth can always use more help. So we'll branch off this way and just run pretty much straight west to Fargo. Do I want to go... I might actually branch off this way, because this route is less used. Something to consider is a second train running from Duluth to Wausau. Because they are really bogged down. Uh, not we'll leave it moderate, moderate. Okay. Let's do this, and then we'll see what we can do. So we'll come out here, and... I don't want to go through those hills, though. Um, Alright. We, we don't want to go through the hills. Oh, caps lock. Or num lock. Illegal. Yes, it would be, wouldn't it? All right, we'll do the hills. We will come this way. Cancel that. How am I going to do this? Yeah, just do it. Big grade. I know, I know. Bridge too long. Where is Fargo? Right there. We're probably going to put it right about there. Whoops. Did I miss the thing? Oh, somebody accepts something now. Okay. I could put it there and I will get this guy, which provides livestock. It'd be nice. You know what I could do? I could put a station here, which will get Fargo, and then build just like a tiny guy over here. So we'll take our livestock that we produce here, over here to get them butchered, and then send them back to Fargo. In that case, I'll put the, the, the thing, the station over here, the terminal over here. Let's do that. And we'll go right there. We're going to do a, we'll do an iron guy. I guess I could do a stone. I have money. I guess I could do a stone one. We will go, oh, I didn't get the priority one done fast enough. We'll do the stone just because we have money there. And we will do a, a, uh, Terminal here. Okay, 
And you know what? We're going to put a depot actually on the same route. There. Station. Oh, really? I have a state. Oh, is there a station limit? Is there really? I can't make any more stations. Well, what do I do now? <laughs> what? What? That changes thing. Really? I knew there was a limit, but I I didn't. Train limit. Ex what? Really? I have both station and train limit exceeded. Nonsense. Where's my priority guy? I have one final job for you. What am I gonna do now? Um. Is the game over? <laughs> I mean, typically the game can go. You can go up to a hundred years, which would end in 1966. Um, I want to be president, though. This is no good. I have to be president. We'll do two of of each. Probably back and forth. Fargo, do you have you have livestock, which which they will take. So take a livestock car, and then on the way back, you're going to do... No, that's the wrong way. Do the same thing, but we'll have a livestock and a food back and forth. You will do livestock and Fargo, and then Duluth will give you food back. Well, that's my priority training. Well, now what do I do? Hmm. Congressional junket. Well, 400 grand. Well, we're just going to leave it, because uh, I don't have a train... To deal with that. I don't know what to do now. I'm out of stations and trains. I forgot there was a. I knew there was a limit, but I'd forgotten that how much it was. I figured it'd be a lot more than that. 1.7 million this time. We are number one. Hmm. Look at this guy. His track is 86 miles long, and he's in second place. Mr. Beard here is down at the bottom. Bank president. We have a long ways to go, though. We have to get. U.S. President. I could dismantle some things just to reach out here, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, that's fine. I don't know if you can change that later. Hmm. I want another train. Let's just see what we can do. Let's see about buying somebody out. We'll crank up the speed, and we'll just kind of watch. We'll sit back for a little bit. Make some money and buy somebody out. Keep an eye on Mr. Beard here. He's at 67 bucks a share. It keeps going up. I'm going to buy it. Who is it? He is Jay Cook, Tuscaloosa, Tuscaloosa and Jackson. There we go. We bought, we bought some shares. We can buy some more. He's up to 71 bucks a share. 76 now. Keep an eye on it. When he goes back down, no, we'll buy more. to 81 there's 30 shares so I own 30,000 30,000 right that was telling me buy some more stock in there I own 40,000 now I guess, and there was $120,000 worth of shares out there. Is that what that means? So I need at least half that. So I need 60000 Maybe I need seventy. I don't know. I still have $3 million. Let's keep doing this. $920,000. Um, he's rising. 97 bucks a share. All right. Let's do one more. That is correct. It's rising. Maybe I need to match the public shares. Let's let it sit for a minute. Oh, wait, let's let it sit till I make some more money, and then we'll see how it goes. And we'll keep an eye on. Look at our stations here. Make sure everyone is looking okay. The ones that were problem. Oh, Milwaukee's having issues too. Who is this guy? Okay, to Wausau. You need to carry more, mister. A mail car and do that back there. Because Wausau has six males and two passengers. Three males, two passengers. You know what? Um, just do an extra mail car. 
each way. Do that. And then this guy's pretty well weighed down. My first train here. He doesn't need so many goods. But he can carry an extra mail car and an extra passenger out of there. You take a mail car back. Okay, so we'll get him under control. You guys are pretty backed up, but I mean, he's running. This is him right here, right? Yeah, he's full. He's about to head back. He could probably use another car. Thunder Bay is overloaded. Seven mail cars. I have two trains here, right? Yeah. We're running as fast as I can. What should I do about Thunder Bay? Should I, do I build another? I can't build any more trains. I can't do that train. Um, I don't know. Indianapolis, let's take a look at you. Look at all the trains. So much traffic. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh man, we're in... Uh, we're actually in the window. We don't have a super overload of things. Indianapolis is finally under control. It only took 40 years or something like that to get it under control, but we finally do, and now Evansville is issues, problems. Um, you, sir, grab an extra passenger and mail car from Evansville. And then that, that should be fine. And... Oh, that's right. We have this new train from Nashville here, running up that way. That was that's helping a lot. Probably, that may have been the big difference with Indianapolis. Springfield's a little little backed up. Oklahoma City is not too bad. Looks like everyone else is okay. We rack up to two million. We can go turbo. Oh, we actually, we're only on, oh, we're on fast. We can turbo it and crank ourselves up to something like a few more million and see if we can buy out these. this guy. Windows are happening. Oh, my bridge went out, but it's okay. No one runs on that ridge. That's the like wooden bridge. That's, you know, you know when you go to the old towns and they have their, their crappy wooden bridges that they spend every other year they're fixing? That's that bridge. It doesn't serve any purpose other than being that old bridge that nobody was to safe, feel safe to drive on because it's always broken. But it's a historical marker. So it's just going to sit there and, and rot away. We'll let the uh, historical folks deal with that one. Springfield's pretty big. Can we buy... How much is this share now? Is it still 110 bucks? Per share. Buy one more of it. Maybe we need to match the public. No, we have more than the public now. I'm not sure. I mean, look at some things like our train income. Who is the big guy? Still, this you know this first train. This is my Duluth to Wausau guy, 152. He's doing nothing. He's new. Oh, 159 Indianapolis to Gary is a big guy. Austin to Abilene. Oh, here we go. Dodge City to what's that? Wichita? Really? That's the big money maker. Wichita to Dodge City. Why? Why are you so hot? Whoa! What's all the suits? Why? Why is it so big? Is it because it's new and it no? Ah, yeah. When you're on <laughs> when you're on super fast speed, it does that. <laughs> it skips everything. We'll keep it on fast. Why is this train? I guess because it's. I don't know why it's so good. You have five cars of wood there that we have no. We can't do, really do anything with it. You don't take wood, do you? No. Wait, you should take wood. Why don't you take wood? Are you out... Is that outside of your radius? Yeah, it is. It's one square outside. Now, one thing we could do is we could build a, a paper mill here in Dodge City. Let's do that. 
right there we'll build an industry we want a paper mill do i want it there if i do it there i'll have to make this a a uh, terminal but that's fine paper mill built and now you sir are going to be whoop, 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 uh, a terminal now accepts grain and wood which you will provide first train in fargo uh, Dodge City to what? Where was it going? Dodge City to Wichita. Just click you. All right. So when you get to Wichita, you're gonna pick up. Uh, actually, Dodge City, you're gonna take wood. Take uh, just do one because you're such a fast train. It might be okay. So run a wood a wood from Dodge City to Wichita. Wichita will take the paper back to Dodge City, who does not take paper. Of course you don't. Well, you can leave the paper there in Wichita, and then surely Tulsa takes paper. So this guy, if I can click him, I want the train, train, I want the train going to Tulsa. This guy, uh, when you're in Wichita, pick up a paper. There you go. So we can do it that way. And my zoom is not working again. Tulsa trestle. Oh, that's a bad one. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Tulsa. That's a very bad one. Um, I think this is the only train running back and forth. I think. Uh, so we're going to tell him to stop. I don't know which one I'm supposed to use. We're going to tell him to stop until... Uh, I think that's the only train running that way because everyone else coming through Tulsa here is going to Tulsa and going back. So that should be okay. Let's make sure he stops. Fast it. Hopefully he stays and doesn't turn back around because I can't build a signal yard if he decides to around. I will be hosed. Man, where is Open Railroad Tycoon where I can <laughs> do things like build more stations? <laughs> All right, so it's good and until that comes back. Gary Central now takes mail. That's the one I was caught. Yeah, I remember that. That's I was in problems with that because Gary wouldn't take mail from Gary, but it does now. It's okay, though. I have it under control. Okay, it worked. The only problem is it's going to hold this guy, too, because I don't know which one need to hold I think this is the one I need to hold but I don't want to risk it because I don't want to mess up and kill my train the mallet is here Ooh, the mallet is big it's expensive but it's it is uh, has a lot of horsepower I can't build another train I just want to look at the trains bridge repaired okay you are good to go there we go okay Oh, he wasn't even going that way anyways. He was going this way. Right? Or is he going? No, there he is. Okay, he's heading that way. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's take a look. All right. You are, you're a Pacific, which is fine. I want a uh, crappier train. Consolidation. You know what? Let's move everybody up to the mallet. You're not quite as fast as the Pacific, but look at the horsepower. Yeah. That's one way we could get... I want to be president. This is my goal. I want to be president. Uh, the one thing we can... One way we could do it is by cranking up these uh, the stations, building uh, like restaurants, post offices, hotels, and all of them. And that would produce more money, which is what we need to get president. Uh, just by buying out this other railroad, though, it might that might do it. Some of these guys are old. Ten wheeler. You don't have any mail. Drop the mail in. You are Pacific. Pacific is fine. 
Anything, any of these green trains, though, need to go. We don't do green in our empire. Pacific is fine. You are green. You got to go. Uh, whoops. I suppose I, you, could, I, you can go through and I could clean up some of my trains, get rid of the ones I don't necessarily need, but I think I need everybody because I can't keep up with the, the what I'm trying to haul already. There might be a few that I could do that with, but man, I don't know. I'm going to include that one. Uh, you know what? While you're in Evansville... Do that. Speaking of a train, I could probably add some more routes to. So we'll give you the mallet. And Pacific is fine. How much money do we have? Are we still doing okay? Oh, it's still two million. Fine. Mikado eh, Mikado's okay. You have Pacific, which is good. You most of these should be pretty well new. Yeah, it's just those guys on top that were still pretty old, old and green. Yeah, you guys are fine. Okay, so that's the the only other thing I can think of is by giving some of these stations more. Uh, you know what? Take another passenger car from each one. Mail might be mail actually might be more important. Where's the Thunder Bay guy? You also had a Sioux Falls. Sioux Falls pretty overloaded. Is it that over? Mail. How you looking, Sioux Falls? Uh, you got some passengers waiting. You already picked up. You just picked up from Sioux Falls. You're bound for Wausau, and you have. Yeah, that's fine. Are you the Thunder Bay guy? Yes. Put on another passenger. Uh, do a mail from Duluth, but on Thunder Bay, do another passenger. Because we need... Whoa, we need help here. Do you have things built here? Yeah, you have hotel, post office, restaurant. Uh, I could go in and give you like a switch yard that'll make you turn around quicker. Something like this. That way, when the train gets in there, it'll switch around quicker. Uh, what about Duluth? Does Duluth have one? I think Duluth already has one. No, you don't. Okay. Yes, you definitely need one. You and Indianapolis, if any stations that give them, you two need the switching yards. I'm not clicking a train. For some reason, it didn't happen. In, it, in the beginning of the game, it was fine. But later on... I started, wait, the zoom doesn't work, and it clicks things for some reason. Almost like this game is 25 years old. Okay, improved station. Do you have a switching yard? You do. Uh, okay, you're fine then. Did you make any money? Oh, we lost money this year because we got our stock profits. <laughs> is that why? Other railroad stock. Year-to-date changes. Two million in a hole. I'm sure you got no maintenance. Because we're buying this guy. How much is he worth now? He's only worth 87 now. Okay, we'll buy some more of him. We'll buy one more of him, I think. Okay, what's he at now? I didn't see what it went to. Oh, he's at $100 a share now. We won't buy him now. Chicago no longer takes goods? What? It's crazy talk. Okay, we own 80,000 shares in his company. I don't know. We can see our stock price. Stuff. Oh, that's everything. What else? There's also efficiency. 
Revenue efficiency, 3.64 per ton mile. Carloads available, 46. Carloads carried, 16. What does this mean? I don't know. Utilization efficiency, 8%. There's also the history, which does the, like you go through watching your train grow, which is kind of cool. We'll do that at the end, though. Um, Nashville. Why don't you give me a switching yard as well? And we'll put one in Evansville, too. There's a lot of trains going through Evansville. That would help. You don't have anything here. Oh, man. Not, uh, not a maintenance shop. Speaking of, train number three got no maintenance last year. we got to figure out why. You need a restaurant, you need a hotel, you need post office. All the things for Evansville. I need a hundred thousand dollar hotel. Okay. And we should probably make sure Gary has all of that as well. Switching yard. You do have switching yard. Good. You're fine. Chicago, no wrong sex. Why don't you accept goods anymore? What's wrong with you, Chicago? You have everything you need. What about you? You have all the good stuff. Switching yard will be... Okay to have. And we'll let it sit for a minute. I think ideally when you buy another competitor, I kind of block this guy off. But you can buy them and then you can tell them where to grow to, which it helps the stock price, which gives you money. But I block them off, so it won't really do me any good. I mean, maybe I could put a hole in my track somewhere down here and let him build all the way over here. I don't know. And then start, start using him. I am not sure. Money is coming in, though. Listen to the dings. Lots of dings. He's still, his stock is still rising. Stop rising, stock. Well, I guess it's okay. 107. Just go down so I can buy it and then go back up. What I could do is once, if it goes up way up, I could sell that stock and make money. Because I started buying out at 59. And if I sell it at like 150 here, so that would be some good money. It should be splitting though. I thought once it hit 100, it split. I'm only at 63. So the public owns 630,000 shares. I own 10. Do I own 10? I thought I did. Maybe not. Um, I own 80. I'm not sure. Uh, I need to put a cut in this uh, video, though. So let me know, those of you that are, are watching this as it comes out, uh, let me know what I can do if you remember this game very well. Should I end it? Should I call it quits? Should I just throw it on turbo and let it go? We do have 55 more years until we're done. I want to be president. There we go. Look at the profit. What? Oh, man. <laughs> That's the way. There we go. 27 got no hands. What's wrong with you, 27? The record. We just doubled our record profits. You gotta get me up there. President. President. Congressman. Well, next step from congressman is president. So anyways, let me know if you have any ideas. I would like to continue this and get president. So if you have any ideas how to get president or what I could do to help that, please let me know. Uh, but thanks for watching. And also let me know how the microphone sounds. I hope it's positioned right and sounds okay. I think so. Uh, thanks for watching though, and I'll see you next time.